Students eating lunch at Union Public Schools are getting fruits, vegetables, and beef from local farms and ranches. The idea to go from farm to cafeteria is to keep the menu fresh. News on 6's Amy Slanchik shows us how it works. At Roy Clark Elementary today, kids were chowing down on an end of summer treat, corn on the cob. Cafeteria staff prepares the corn after it makes the short 45-minute trip from down the road in Porter at Levesey Orchards. Cantaloupe is on the menu, too. There you go, my princess. You have a great lunch. Soon, even more produce will be ready. These are purple hole peas. And you can see they're still immature, but I don't think it'll be long before those are ready. Kent Levesey showed me the watermelon patch, where one by one they're harvested with kids in mind. It's nice to see uh, children getting fresh food from our farm. This is the second school year Levesey Orchards has worked with Union, but it's the district's 15th year buying food from local farms. Union buys blueberries and asparagus from a Broken Arrow farm. The district turns to Bixby for blackberries, bok choy, and other fruits and veggies. Lettuce and tomatoes are grown in Sand Springs. A farm in central Oklahoma provides potatoes. And beef is no mystery meat. The district buys it from a ranch in Okarchi. That's about $300,000 going into our economy staying here in Oklahoma and feeding our kids really good quality food. Child Nutrition Director Lisa Griffin grew up on a farm and is happy to put in the extra work it takes to coordinate with farmers and have a flexible menu based on what's available each week. I love feeding these kids nutritious foods and it I know it makes them feel better and, and perform better in school. Growing fresh fruits and veggies for growing young minds. In Porter, Amy Slanchik, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.